states relations about how minorities and a lot of the left, unfortunately, view Donald Trump as being some kind of racist bigot. That would have been a great opportunity to capitalize right there, right then, without hesitation. And as far as this deal, you know, he touted it with carrier air conditioning in Indiana when he was on the stump with the coal miners who could bring the coal back, open up the the mothballed uh, power companies, but get people back into the shafts, taking the coal out. But making good on promises, yeah, that would have been the great tweet for West Virginia and for the economy. But no, everything else superseded it. So, yeah, more, less for the haters, more for the base. Not not getting distracted by the negativity because there are always going to be negative people out there. Just, just focus, Mr. President, on your successes. Focus in on your incentives, focusing on getting tax reform passed, health care fixed, more jobs, get the wall built. There's so many other issues other than worrying about how the media is going to react. They don't want you to be president to begin with. So as long as you are president, we already know you are. They won't accept it, but your base knows. Carry on, Mr. President. We salute you. We're behind you. We voted for you. So please stop worrying about these idiots out there. There's always going to be idiots. There's always going to be negative people out there that no matter how much good you do, it's never good enough. For whatever reason, there's people that are like Eeyore. That's that's in their DNA. That they're 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 Eeyores. Oh hum, you know it could be a great granny, great day, sunshine, blue skies, low humidity, perfect temperatures. Drink a mimosa, you know. Uh, what do you want? Grapefruit in that? Oh, you're doing grapefruit this time. Okay, mmm, nice mimosa. Mm-hmm. It's delicious. You you don't know what a mimosa? Oh, you a little champagne. Oh, yeah, and a little grapefruit juice. You can put some orange juice in there. But, man, yeah, good, good champagne. Mel Tillis, as you know, passed away. And I think we're probably going to have to do a little, uh, should we do a Mel Tillis? Do you know any good Mel Tillis songs, though? That's the good question. Oh, he has, Mel Tillis has some of the most greatest but i don't know what he the guy has like tons and tons of hits all right let's just go through a few of them let's shall we let's just have a little fun here mel tillis died on sunday in ocala florida so we're gonna have a, a little tribute piece see if you recognize some of these songs we're just gonna gotta go through the song list here just for fun commercial affection is the name of this for any of you Mel Tillis fans. And if you're not, become a fan. Here he is. I was lonely, I guess, the night that we met in a tavern down on old Broadway. All right. It ain't never. Memory maker, Mel Tillis, remembering his life, his music. It's a little tribute to a man who changed music, country music, that is. A lot of people uh, got started in the music business because of Mel. This is kind of like older stuff. It's got anything newer. This is a 2010. He came out with an album then. So this is a little bit more recent here. This is Hunting Buddies. Well, 
We're hunting buddies, old Tom and I. We've got our losses, boy. We're bona fide. Heaven help us should we ever get lost. Cause Tom can't see and I can't talk. It's going to take us both to get there, Tom. All right, biscuit in the pocket. Bill Tillis died over the weekend if you're just joining us. I have no uncle down there. His name was Uncle Ernest. That's his heart. He's deceased now. And he had a little gas station, a little old spur station. And he was on the outskirts of Pahokee. And he didn't have indoor plumbing in it, you know. Um, But he had an outhouse out to one side and thankful for that. One day he caught old R.D. out there with a fishing pole of fishing in that middle hole. <laughs> oh, yeah, he would just it, get, 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 get like he's jigging for crappie or something. <laughs> and Uncle Ernest said, R.D., he said, now what on earth are you doing? And R.D. said, Uncle Ernest, I dropped my jacket off over there and I'm trying to pitch it out of there. <laughs> and he said, you ain't going to wear it, are you? He said, no, sir, but I got a biscuit in the pocket. <laughs> and he had an old preacher down there in Pihoke. He was self-ordained. <laughs> yeah, he ordained himself. And his name was the and his name was the, uh, was the Reverend Jenkins Wright was his name, and he loved to and man he had he had a little church but he had it full almost almost every every time he preached he had her full because he liked to have dramatic effects around him when he preached, yeah you know and man he he'd really draw them people in there, and he had his own uh, own method and you know. I mean, he knew the Bible, but he didn't, he didn't go exactly by it, you know. <laughs> and he went out, and he, one day, he needed a dramatic effect, and he bought himself a parrot. <laughs> he bought himself a parrot, and he taught the parrot to talk and strike matches. And he cut a hole up above the pulpit. And he said, now look, he's a parrot. And the parrot said, what is it? He said, now listen. He said, now Sunday night, the church is going to be packed because I'm going to put out some posters all over on all the telephone poles. I'm going to have the posters out. It's going to be packed. And here's what I want you to do. Whenever I say, and the fire came down from heaven, I want you to strike the match and I want you to drop it out that hole. And the parrot said, I can do that. And the Sunday night... <laughs> Oh, the church was just, man, it was packed. Because the flyers was out, the posters was out, it was packed. And he'd be preaching for about 45 minutes, and they kept hollering, Hey, hey, Reverend, when the fire coming down from heaven? <laughs> you know, they wanted the fire. They wanted to see the fire. Well, finally he got the message, and, uh, and he said, And the fire came down from heaven. More for the people right around the corner. It's done like anything you've ever been through in your life, man. I was driving. This uh, kid threw a grenade at us. It went right over our vehicle. It was 12 years old. The shockwave went through my head rattled up my brain and left. Danger is around you 360 degrees at all times and you can't unlearn that. It's impossible to describe the sacrifices these men and women have made to protect our freedoms. And the job of rebuilding their lives is massive and growing every day. Many will need the programs offered by the Wounded Warrior Project for years to come. I didn't know what PTSD was. All I knew was I was having nightmares. And when I got released, my reintegration was, go check in at the VA, man. My first coping mechanism was use drugs. Just numb it, don't feel anything. I was angry. I'm trying to pull myself out of that right now. Your gift today of $19 per month will honor and empower these veterans so they can aid and assist each other. The Wounded Warrior Project is a life raft 
I can say this without question that I wouldn't be here today if it weren't for it. The Wounded Warrior Project is, is the first step getting back out into the world and reforming yourself outside of the service. Call or go online with a pledge of $19 a month. You'll receive this Wounded Warrior Project blanket and your gift will provide critically needed programs that rebuild lives. That was my first feeling of actually being a part of something bigger than myself again. Well, I lost a few really close friends overseas, and if I quit, I'm going to let them down, and I'm not about to do that. I'm learning to face my fears head on. To trust and see what happens at the end. It's a long process, but I had to drive and desire. Please, call or go online with your gift right now. For the people is there. Lord Cornwallis British troops dug the little earthen forts called redoubts in Yorktown, Virginia. But in the long haul, they offered little protection from America's allies, the French artillery. And on October 19, 1781, for all intents and purposes, the war was over. Midst military pomp and proper protocol, the soldiers of the world's most powerful king surrendered to tattered rebels who had defied imperial power in the name of a new idea, liberty. This has been Don Keyes with a sketch of Yorktown, a sketch in red, white, and blue in your American heritage. Proudly presenting your American heritage Monday through Friday right here on this station. Please let a friend know about your American heritage and join us. Introducing the official For the People coffee mug featuring the colorful red, white, and blue For the People logo with Keith Allen on a ceramic 11-ounce coffee mug, perfect for any hot beverage of your choice. This mug is a great reminder of what we stand for, God, country, and family, with conservative values and good old-fashioned common sense. To order your For the People coffee mug, pay just $20 plus $3.99 shipping and handling at ForThePeopleShow.com. That's ForThePeopleShow.com. And enjoy. AM, 40 million Americans are waking up to a Gillette shave. And at our factory in Boston, 1,200 workers are starting their day building on over 100 years of heritage, craftsmanship, and innovation. Today, we're bringing you America's number one shave at lower prices every day, putting money back in the pockets of millions of Americans. As one of those workers, I'm proud to bring you Gillette Quality for Less because nobody can beat the men and women of Gillette. Gillette, the best a man can get. With all the choices out there to enjoy some entertainment, wouldn't it just be nice to have something that didn't cost an arm or a leg? I found something that does just that. It's called 123 Ready TV. It's one of the most remarkable apps available to start watching all of those movies and TV shows for one incredible price, just $19.99. And that's a one-time only price. Recap, all your movies, current and classic, and sports and news, and so much more. So cut the cable and stop spending money at the movies when you can truly have it all at your fingertips. No commercials, just all the entertainment you desire. 123 Ready TV is available for Windows and all Android devices. Get your 123 Ready TV for just $19.99 at ForThePeopleShow.com. That's ForThePeopleShow.com. Just click on the store page to get yours now and start enjoying entertainment the way it was supposed to be. Fun. Real news with common sense for the people continues on your radio. I'm Keith Allen. Some of you are traveling already, getting ready for a big turkey day on Thursday. And I'm one of these saps. I mean, I'm just going to call myself. I like the Macy's Day Parade. I was thinking about jettisoning you to LaGuardia or Newark Airport just to be there in Manhattan for the parade. but. I'm 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 not going to do it. I'm just going to watch it on television. I have a 70-inch theater at home, 
It's ridiculous. And with all the surround sound, 